Hey everybody, it's Savage Sage and welcome back to my let's play of Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. I just ate some pizza in between episodes real quick, but we are still here. We're fresh minded, don't even worry. <laughs> this game definitely seems to work out better for me if I do like recording sessions as opposed to individual videos because I forget what the heck we're doing. <laughs> oh man. That's okay, that's okay. We have got our footing now. We are at the Bridge of Evil, I believe. Rode the crazy train, fought a boss, barely survived, and here we are. All of these walls look like they could be false walls. There is one. Haha. <laughs> HP max up. We always appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> look, there's blood on the walls. Yeah. <laughs> so now we just explore. Now we did see Zangetsu, which I'm always kind of nervous about, which he helped us this time, but like, I just know we're gonna have to fight him again at some point. I'm sure that's gonna happen. Because he just keeps popping up and he freaking hates us. And I'm just not ready for that. Because last time he kind of kicked our ass a bit. Well, okay. Looks like we need to move on. Alright, we're going to a new area. A little transitional screen. I'm down for it. Underground Sorcery Lab. What a name. Alright, let's get ready. These guys are going to be tough, and we've got to be on our toes. Alright. This little s what? How do you even pronounce that? Side? Sidhi? <laughs> I don't know. Oh my god, the doggo is loose. Back it up, doggo. You got a long ass chain. Ooh, we got a level. Sick. Oh, we got his shard, which is... What? We should actually check out our shards. Resist strike. Increase your resistance to striking attacks. Okay, that could be useful. A stinger, that's neat. Alright, so let's check out our shards, because we were just talking about that, right? I love Welcome Company on. Like, that's literally my favorite. Bunny Morphosis, not really so down for it, but what else am I going to use right now? Like, um, I guess I kind of like the Beast Man there. I don't really use that button that often. And then this one is the Dragon, or it could be Swing a Massive Fist in the general direction or acid jet which i'm not really interested in Ooh, that now that sounds good strike them with lightning that always finds them no matter what you can give that a shot this one increases the numbers of tame from crafting which is good but we might want to switch it to sword expertise a little bit more just because we always are using a sword. And I love the Silver Knight. The Caraboos and the Dola Hammerhead have not been super useful for us. And he's level 20, rank 4. He's doing good, my boy. So we're just going to keep him on for now. For now. We might switch our mind if we find a better familiar later. So I guess more than anything, we want to try this lightning strike. How do I do that? Oh. Well, okay. That actually doesn't seem like that good of a move, but I don't usually use that button in some fights, but maybe I should try to a little bit more, test it out a bit. I'm down for that. Alright, so this place seems okay so far. Okay, this is getting creepy. Um, wait, why are you here? Oh, hello, casually walking up on you in this creepy laboratory, what the fuck? Dominique, what are you doing here? Looking for Zangetsu. Have you seen him? Oh yeah, we saw him. Yes. We fought together aboard the train. Perhaps I misjudged his intentions. What? Zangetsu was with you. But that's... Is something wrong? I asked him to go to the underground sands. But he must have chosen to disregard that request. If you see him again, would you ask him to report back to me? Oh yeah, because we're on such great terms. Alfred could spring a trap on any one of us at any time. I hope Zangetsu gets his priorities straight. Thank you, Miriam. And stay safe. Thanks, Dominique. It's kind of weird that you were just hanging out here, but... I, I guess it's fine. She's our friend, right? Right? Whatever. So let's... Oh, good. Frog shards. Just what we needed in our lives. Little froggy frogs. Resist poison. Actually, that's kind of nice. We have been poisoned a time or two. We hated it. Let's check up top. Because there's clearly some stuff going on. Some tomfoolery up here to be had. What? 
How am I supposed to reach? Oh, we must be getting the transformation thing at some point here. We must. I mean, how else are you going to reach that door? That is my gut. Is that a freaking boss door? The fuck? What makes them think I'm ready for a boss right now? That's wild. We just got here. We'll come back to that. Oh, nope. This is just the save room before the boss. So we're going to have a boss. All right. Didn't we just have one of those? We're down for it, though. We just had a couple, I feel like. Of course, we just got poisoned. I don't want to deal with that. Yay, more resist poison. Maybe I should consider it. Well, we're not going in here with full HP necessarily, but we'll see. God, I'm getting so many of those sharks. What the hell? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who are you? Excuse me, sir. Bathin? What an entrance that was. Shooting me with the... Whoa, spikes everywhere? What the hell? Oh. Okay, this guy's kind of creepy and scary. Let's just deal as much... Oh my god, oh my god. Ooh, <laughs> he is a quick-moving boy. That spikes on our bodies. I was gonna... Okay, okay. He has a simple enough pattern, I guess. We can figure it out eventually. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. <laughs> that was scary. Oh my gosh. Can you not do that, sir? What the hell is that? Oh my god. That was terrifying. Is this guy gonna kill us right now? Is that gonna happen? Because I'm gonna be pretty upset about that. Hell yeah, get those. I don't know how I'm supposed to dodge those lasers. That was wild. Okay, good. We barely beat him. Oh my gosh, Speed Demon. That was wild. <laughs> We're having so many close calls this run, guys. <laughs> Hello. What'd you give me? Reflector ray. Travel along a ray of light. You can reflect off walls and reach new areas. Oh, that is not what I thought it was going to be. Hold up. We need to run and save. That was too much. Stay away from me, please. Everything. I'm not trying to get freaking hit right now. Or poisoned of all freaking things. Stay away from me. Oh, we got a thing from you. What is that? Void Wiles. Cause an explosion in a direction. Sick. Oh my god, oh my god. Yes! Alright, safety. That was a close-ass call, guys. But now we have a new shard. Which I'm excited to try out. It's a purple one. Which we were just doing with the lightning. But now we're going to do... Reflector Ray. Travel along a ray light and you can reflect off walls and reach new areas. I'm kind of scared about that, but it sounds sick. Nice, our little buddy got to level up. Never can complain about that. So then, what are we doing here? And then what, I launched that way? Like, I don't understand. So I use this laser. And then what? <laughs> what am I missing here? Reflect off walls and reach new areas. I thought it was going to be like a leaping ability or something. What, it's just a straight-ass laser? Well, how is that useful? I guess what? We're going to have to use that for... Because obviously it's like used for this. I don't... Then what do you do after that? Am I missing something? Whatever, we'll figure it out. We don't understand it, but we have it. Stinger! 
Well, that guy was crazy. He was leaping all around. That's why I kind of maybe thought we'd get something like that. But I don't understand what that does or what it is. So, who on that? Oh, you're a mimic. Hello. Get out of my face. I didn't like that. Rude ass mimics. Vespin Stinger again. I don't get it. How do I get this? I'm clearly missing something, guys. What a shock. <laughs> okay, so this is a warp. Is that like... What? <laughs> what? Let's go back home real quick and collect some of our rewards. Because we have been doing the reward things for the lady. And then we'll go back there and figure out whatever the hell. We also got a big chunk of money, so maybe we should buy, like, potions or something since I keep dying. Well, I haven't died yet, but you know what I mean. I well, I've died, but not in this recording session. Here's what I've turned up Let's see. Yes, give us whatever. The cut purse's ring. What is that? Oh, wrong button. What does that mean? The cut purse's ring. A ring that makes enemies more likely to drop gold. That's kind of nice. Let's equip that for a little bit. Because that should be good for us. That should be very good for us. Alright, and then let's go over here and see if there's anything new that we can do. Hi, Miriam. Hello. What are we transmuting this time? We don't know. Um... I do want potions, but I'll just buy them. As far as weapons, I'm sure we're caught up, right? I don't see him being able to do anything. Even this axe is not as good. We're at 44 attack. Like, we're freaking bosses right now. So, yeah, we can't get any of that stuff. You really can't do anything for us right now, sir. If you ever encounter a demon named Bale, we're up. I haven't. But I'm curious why I should. Because he's the most powerful of the 72 demons. A quick escape may be the only thing that saves you. Okay, well, we will keep that in mind. That's creepy, but let's go buy potions and stuff real quick. We must, we must. Hello. Another message arrow has arrived from Zangetsu. Oh, good. What does he have to say? In this chamber where the bell tolls, seek the demon woman basking in blood. A female vampire, perhaps? Huh. Vampires drink blood. They don't bask in it. Wait, there's more. The room was an ocean of gore. From some grisly battle, perhaps. I'm confused. I'm reading this right. The demon he spoke of was able to instantly collect this blood without laying hand or lips on it. Well, that means even the slightest wound in her presence would put me in danger. She won't be easy to defeat. You had best go in prepared. Who is this lady? A freaking, like, crazy vampire chick? The fuck? Um, what am I looking to buy? Oh, you could buy 8 bitcoins and 16 bitcoins here if you were desperate enough. Allows you to purchase. Well, wow. 100,000. That would be a lot. Beret of Bravery, which would raise our attack and defense and strength. That's actually pretty dang good. Let's maybe buy it. Is this right? And equip it, sure. We'll put it on our head. It might look silly, but it's fine. And then let's use the rest of our money on potions. Wow. That will not get us a lot. But at least it's something. So, let's sell some shards. Let's literally do it, because we don't use most of these. Cerulean Splash, sure. 
Gale Crawler. We don't use that. Head Flail I actually did like for a while, and it's rank 3 and stuff, so we'll keep that. Summon Ghost I did kind of like. Oh, Summon Gearmond I didn't like. I don't think I'd use that. Same with the Summon Instinct. Flytrap, no. Of course Welcome Company is staying, and we'll keep bring We haven't used that, so we'll keep it. The bunny morphosis, I don't know what that does, so we'll keep it for now. This was dumb. Uh, we'll keep flame cannon, actually. Bone toss, no. True arrow, no. Release toad, no. Directed shield, sure. I did like heretical grinder for a while. Sell this, sell this. We have three of those, sell those. We'll keep that because that's new. We'll keep that. As far as these guys, I want to keep... I won't be using firearms. We'll keep the rest of them, though. Cool, and that allows us to buy just a couple more things if we want to. Which I think we should maybe buy a couple high potions and more potions. We can only hold nine, but let's have them. Let's just have them. Like, why not? And order made scarf. Nope, that's not good for us. Thank you. I'll be no problem. Oh, we love our new fancy beret. It's great. It's lit. It's lush. We're good. We're prepared for once in our life. This lady wants pizza. Did you bring? No, I have a rice ball. I kind of forgot about the whole cooking thing, and I'm not about to remind myself. <laughs> not at this time. All right, so let's see. Hold on, hold on. So I feel like I am missing something with this ray thing. We have to teleport with it somehow. And the thing is, is like, how? How am I going to do that? I'm confused. I'm confused. But let's warp back. Where were we? Underground secret laboratory. That is where we were hanging out. Because from what I understand, this thing's going to help us get stuff. Right? Oh, let's read this. This might help us. Force Blast. Draw your sword's magical power and unleash it on enemies. And this works for a bunch of different weapons. What Sarg's called right now, though? The Harpe. I didn't see that on there. But we'll keep that in mind. Get you out of here. Goodbye. You're a mimic still, right? Jerk. Oh, what could the mimic give me? Money is power. Increase your stats proportional to your wealth. Wow. I don't think that would be very good for us right now, but I think that could be super useful later when we have a shit ton of money. Healing. Gradually heal whilst this shard is active. Oh. Hold on. Yes. That's what we need. <laughs> we need healing. We've always needed healing. Thank you so much for being alive, thing. So then we need to... Hello. Oh, okay. That's how we do it. Silver power ring. Let's check that out. Ring that increases attack power in portion to the number of monsters you've slain. Now that's interesting. That'll probably get better as time goes on. But right now we want the money thing. I see. I was doing it wrong. I was like holding R2 before, and you just need to like point it out with the right analog stick and then hit R2. Which, okay, that makes sense. And then. Is there like. Anything around here? No. Fine. So then using that same strat, we can get up here yeah. right yes oh my gosh big black kitty macaron hello 
Wow, that guy, you had a lot of HP, sir. He looks like he was about to yeet me. Oh, that's a fake wall. Hell yes, brother. Got another HP max up. Stoked about that. That's always good. Ooh, I can't see my timer anymore. And I need to see my timer. Oh, we're still doing pretty okay on time. This is what? Another shortcut. Oh, I have not been using those. I'm sure there's a way to use those super efficiently. But I just have not been yet. Don't swipe me. Oh my gosh. 77. How rude. But we got a level up from it. Oh, what'd you give me, sir? Toxic Storm. Whip up a poisonous whirlwind in front of you. Oh my gosh. Well, that's very interesting. Get $100 right there. Just chilling. Let's go ahead and save. And then we can kind of figure out what we're doing next in this area. So we have to keep continuing through here, but exactly where is the question? Because it kind of looked like a dead end for the most part. But I'm not sure. Oh. Okay. Actually, yeah, guys, it, there's seriously... I'm kidding. We have to go to the warp now. So now that we have this reflector ray thing, right? I think that's what we use for all those weird-ass areas we were thinking of before. Firstly being, there was one at Liver X Mahina. There was another one at... Where was it? It was towards the beginning, and it had, like, the capacity up thing. I remember seeing it. I remember, I remember. Okay. So... That opens up probably a couple loose ends for us. That might make swimming a thing <laughs> literally because you might be able to just like bounce your way over there that makes a lot of places possible that makes me want to check out the waterfall more that makes me want to check out this big room over here to the left in between these two places but for right now let's just go to livera ex mahina because we know this one's right here it's literally been taunting us since the dawn of time like literally forever so, let's do that. Let's freaking do it. Boys and girls. Yeah, because here it is. And so then you can somehow what? Oh my god, oh my god. This is wild. What's the best way to go about this? Like that? That's going to make me go, woo, over here. Wow. Okay. Not going to complain. That was wild. So now we can actually, like, go through this place? Is that what I'm understanding? Hello. Large, large A. Okay. This looks dangerous. I kind of want to find a save room <laughs> or something. Kind of a base of operations before going too much farther. Oh my gosh. This place is wild so far. Okay, so we need to ride these books around. Let's do it. This is going to be hella scary, but it's fine. It's all fine and dandy. Ugh. Get up on this one, and let's check up here out. Hello? Hello, I'm kind of scared. Okay, a thunder elemental. And this guy's riding a tank, that's scary. Screw you, that wasn't too bad though, actually. What else is around here? Hello. This looks like it could be a save room. Nope. Right now we're just kind of blindly going around because <laughs> this is totally new. It just opened up so much for us right now getting past here oh do 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 all right all right we can ride this all the way up and take this to where where are we going oh it's a mimic i was like hello what is it <laughs> i was like waiting i was like did i get anything well that was rude freaking mimics everywhere now this music is so calming which is very intriguing for the kind of place this is because this place does not give me a calming vibe at all this is what? Walnut and garlic, okay. No... Bro... <coughs> Oof, no wall or anything, so that kind of sucks. But it's whatever. Okay, this is a very interesting setup. They obviously just shift. <gasps> you jerk! Oh my god, you almost killed me. These, like, dull ahead hammers or whatever running around. I didn't notice them, and he almost knocked me into the freaking spikes. 
That would have been so bad. Oh, that looks like a boss room to me. We've had a lot of bosses, but if there's a boss room, then there's a save room. Yes. Perfect. So we'll save here. This will be kind of our base of operations. And let's explore a little bit more. We know the boss is right over there. That's good to know. Um, but we have so much more of this place to really explore. Because I just ran here. And so I bet there's lots of treasures, lots of chests, maybe powers and stuff we want to check out. Before I go over there and do something cr What? <laughs> Two boss doors? Hello. So those are going to be like branching paths, if I could guess. So let's just go back. Like I said, I want, let's explore. Let's fill out this map. We didn't really do too much around here. Hello, sir. Who the hell are you? Lance Armor. Get away from me. Let me see. Lance Expertise or whatever. Yeah, that makes sense. Spear Expertise. I would expect him... I would expect no less from him to drop. Okay, what the hell is going on here? The same thing, but now they want me to push a bookshelf, it seems. For some reason. Oh my gosh, there's a freaking dragon down here. Maybe warn a boy about a dragon? Let's kill it. I bet we can take it, right? We've we've had worse. Yes. Ha ha ha. Let me beat you, sir. What is over here? A little more exploring to do, eh? Hello, chair, you fake. Chair mimic. Hate you. They take advantage of your goodwill to just want to sit down in a chair for Miriam. 100G. Cool. Why the heck not? Let's keep exploring a little bit. Yes, yes, yes. Back it up, back it up. No, no, no. Um. Okay. You think you're special? What the hell? She's like a rock star. tri wheel Booer. And then... Takamo death. Hello. That She was kind of sick. That was kind of cool. Scary at first, but it ended up being cool. Let's see what's around these parts. I don't want to just jump down, because who knows what's down here. I guess it's safe. Safe-ish. Let's go ahead and do whatever this does. Oh! A little bridge. Thank you so much. Maybe I should have explored the underneath part first. But it's fine. Hello, sir. I would like to read that bookshelf. You probably have some stuff for me. Oh, this is for stuff I don't have. But cool. Um, What was that one shard healing? That's a manipulative shard. How do I do the manipulative shards again? Oh, like that. Wow, it doesn't heal you very much. and takes a shit ton of your HP. It might be more useful once we power that up. Which, next time we go home, we should power stuff up. We oh god, oh god, oh god. We almost just died. There's a freaking dragon over there, but I don't know how much I want to do that. I almost want to just get to a warp. You're a fake chair. Get out of here. Don't offer me comfort. Um. Oh my gosh. Woo! <laughs> this is terrifying. This place is absolutely scary. But let's go... Let's actually end the episode off like that. Let's go back home like we were just talking. Let's upgrade some shards. Let's save. This thing is sick. That is not what I thought was going to happen. I thought we were going to transform into like a bat or something. Like you do in like the old Castlevania games. That's kind of what seemed more prevalent or more obvious to me. And I'm honestly super stoked that they didn't do that. Because that would have been basic. And I'd be like, oh yeah, this is familiar. This laser teleporting whatever thing. That's sick. Alright, lady, do you have anything new for us? Got any targets for? Here's what I've turned up on These are the same ones that I'm already working on, right? And I'll kill them as I see them. But... You don't have any others. Okay, fine. Sir, we would like to upgrade some of our shards, please. Um, Toxic Storm, I don't really care about that. Welcome Company, yes. If I can upgrade that, let's always upgrade that. Thank you. Get this thing so strong. Love it. Alright, and then healing. Yes. Oh, it takes potions to upgrade. Well, that might be worth it in the long run, because we could really pump this thing up. Oh, now it's taking high potions. I like it. But let's just keep doing it. 
I can buy more high potions later. I like it. But having that enhanced healing is going to be super useful. Um, any of these I'm not really using. I can't really pump up anybody else, huh? Well, that's unfortunate. Prepare. Oh, you do the food. Do you have pizza? This, this lady over here wants pizza. I need pizza dough and cheese. Where the am I gonna find pizza dough, dude? You think I'm just gonna find that on the street? The fuck? Well, we'll work on that. Shard research has advanced during the ten years you slept. I would assume so. How so? By using alchemy to add new matter to the shards, we can change their properties. They evolve. For example, an offensive shard's range may widen or reach targets further away. Ah, so they'll become easier to use. To put it more simply, yes. But I should make special mention of enchantment shards. They require a large number of materials to transmute, but they function similarly to skill shards. In other words, they work even when you don't have them equipped. That is quite an advancement. Nice. So then let's check out our healing now. Is it better? Wow. Still terrible. But it might come in handy one day. You never know. We'll stick. Let's save. And we'll end it off there for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel so you can see more content like this. In the next episode, I guess we will go explore Livra Mahina a little bit more. Um, because there's two boss doors, there's lots of map to complete, so we will have our hands full. We will be busy next episode, so we'll be taking care of that, and I will see you guys then.